Howdy my friends and welcome back to more Let's Play Gran Turismo 4 and man look at this sweet Camaro LM race car that we won in the last session there doing these stars and stripes. We're going to get in this baby now because I think we actually will need it for what we're going to do. And the only thing I'm going to do is buy some different tires. That's all I'm going to do. I'm not going to equip these. Because I don't know how long these races are. But just in case, I want to have them. And that's it. That's all we're doing. So American events. 35,000. So win 85,000 from this. That's a, that'll give us back up to th above 300,000 because we sucked and wasted money in the last part because we couldn't enter a car after we uh, tuned it up. All right, let's do this. I didn't even read the little th deal there. It probably would have told me something. Oh God, we got the Chaparral 2D and Chaparral 2J. Oh my, this is going to be challenging. That freaking 2J. I forgot all about that. Alright, so there's a Chaparral 2J in that. So you know what? I decided I'm going to get, am going to get the nitrous because I don't think we're going to have a chance otherwise. Could even get that, but I think we can do this maybe. But I think also I'm going to want to qualify on each race so that I don't have to go through all the other cars. Which is going to be annoying because it'll be longer, but I will. It'll be worth it, I think, in the long run. Alright, so there's five races here. All five American tracks. Let's do it. All right, y'all, so we finally got the 2J. I had to do it like three times, but yeah, all you gotta do is just exit and then, and then uh, when it prompts you to come back to it, say that you don't want to continue, and then you just say, you say yes that you'd like to withdraw. So, so just hopefully I won't need that nitrous. I don't, I don't know why I'm on brakes. I don't know what the heck I'm doing. Uh, driving aids. Minimize all this. Alrighty, and transmission, leave that alone. Downforce, sorry, maximized. Limited slip. I'm actually going to leave that on 10. Alright, so let's do this. And I'm going to try to practice give me a little better chance to beat it because we're you know I'll just say it to the end of the practice all right so there we get it yay but four and a half seconds it's a little encouraging but uh huh, I wonder I wonder if it's really a sign of things to come oh yeah I all mean, oh, that 2j it does not play 117 point race I'm actually surprised the Viper got last, but it did apparently. It did. Oh, y'all. And I'll be driving this way because, well, I do better this way. Oh, God, here it comes. Man, that two chai, y'all. I love it, but man, I hate right, racing against it. I hate racing against it. I mean, it really, if you ask me, it pretty much compares to like the Sauber Mercedes and the R92 Cup car and Toyota GT1, cars like that, man. I mean, it really, 
is up there in his performance. Okay, this far here, across this train track, I suggest letting off the gas so that the car remains stable because, yeah, you can really lose control going over that train track, let me tell you. And that's something you don't want to happen, you know. I'm just saying, you really, you don't want it to happen. You might think you do, but you don't. That 2J will come flying past you. I'm actually surprised that I'm keeping him at bay. Really surprised. Yeah, I definitely recommend qualifying because if you start at the back and try to work your way through the others and everything, you're probably not going to get to him. I mean, because he will just pull away, I mean, without any holding back. Okay, I'm going to let off the gas. I'm not getting the best performance, you know, on this section, but it's better to take it safe than sorry. Definitely want the car to be stable through that. Don't want to take any chance of losing control. Two second lead on him somehow. The rest of the track you really don't have to worry too much about. You know, aside from just avoiding hitting the walls and everything. You know, your typical Seattle situation like that right there. You do not want to hit the inside of the walls. Because, uh, well, you'll just kind of ping pong on back, you know, ricochet on back and out of control more often than not. second behind. Waiting on me to miss it. Oh my gosh. Way too close. Oh my gosh, y'all. Oh. I don't know how he got so worse in the qualifying, unless others were just slowing him down that much. I'm going to say that's probably what it was. It's always something. A little bit bad being so brutal there, but I feel like I kind of have to be. Oh, I hate that part there. Hate it. She is right on me. Get away. That was... No, well, that wasn't my best lap. I'm 
No. No, no, no. Seriously, you are not going to win. You're a babe. Oh my gosh. Wish I could be more aggressive on this section here, but I can't because look what the car does. Oh, y'all. I told you. I told you. Oh, that 2J, golly. And the Ford GT LM2 got last. Oh, for some reason I thought that was... Yeah, I should know that the GT40 really isn't that good. Well, we won the first race. <laughs> you can see how this whole series probably is going to go, though. Oh, yeah. Thing. That two J. Yeah. Peacefully stayed behind for a little while. Oh gosh. All right. Hallelujah. Ten thousand there should be more, but I'll take it. All righty, Infineon Raceway. All right, so once again, I'm gonna try to qualify. Okay, let's see how we did. Oh wow, five point seven. I think we're good. That even wasn't that good of a lap either. All right, let's do this. Come on, Camaro. 117 more race. Oh lordy. This is a thing. Dip one will start out first though. Any other championship? It wouldn't even matter. But, you know, any, anytime you don't have the 2J. I wonder if he'll actually do good at this track because the computers tend to not do so good at this track so maybe this one will be a little easier. Maybe. I mean, it looks like we're pulling away right now. Yeah, let's see if this comes. Yeah. Oh man, I better get serious. Or stay serious or something. Golly, he's staying back there. He's being awfully nice on this race. Car. I'd appreciate it if you'd steer. He's not even really getting that far ahead of the other ones. He's going to let me run away with this, maybe. Unless I screw up, which is very possible. But I don't want to imagine that. I don't want to imagine that possibility. Really don't. Okay, 
taking that a lot faster. Oh well, we we got a good lead right now. Until he just suddenly probably zooms up here. So it's eating me up. How dare I miss that cone? How could I do such a thing? Golly, seven seconds. I'm liking the way this is going. Let's see how bad my lap time is when I drive like this. I'm a little brave since I got such a good lead. Although I'm still afraid what would happen if he got ahead. Actually is closing the gap. Seems like he does better after the first couple laps. Maybe because his tires warm up or something. He is a very lightweight car. I mean, golly, that freaking 2J is in the same league with the freaking. Sober Mercedes and stuff like that, so. So I wonder if this Camaro has a chance at all. We were holding our own. That lap actually was not really, not really much worse. Pretty much about the same. Nine point five seconds. I like it. Nice, safe little distance ahead. I can do. I can deal with that. You just stay on back there, TJ, and by, while you're at it, you can do this on every race. Oh, man, this track just works in my favor because the AI just sucks on it. So I have a feeling the other three races are not going to be this easy. I know Laguna Seca is going to be one of them, and I, I kind of dread that one because I suck at Laguna Seca. And the AI really isn't that bad at it. Eleven seconds, golly. This actually might have been the best lap. Feeling pretty good about it. Yeah. Not feeling good about this one though. I definitely want to break early on these corners. Definitely is a must. Oh, yeah. oh you can see another car on the other side there. I don't know who it was. Gosh, y'all, this championship's gonna be so difficult. But you do win, like, probably my favorite car in the game, or one of my favorite cars in this game. I have a lot of cars I love in this game. It's hard to pick just, you know, one specific, but this car here I do love. Ooh, man. I 
Oh, there's the 2J. I think they actually see him to the right there. A little too late, though, buddy. That last lap kind of sucked, though, on my part. Whew. Well, the 4GT actually got fourth in that one. The Corvette was last. Probably was flying off in those corners. 10 second lead. Wow, what a difference. If I were, they all would go that smoothly. I'm not expecting it. At all. Oh my, y'all. What's next? What is next? I'm kind of scared to find out. I know El Capitan's in one of these races. So El Capitan, Laguna Seca, and I forget the other one. I can't think of it right this second. All right, so next race here is at New York. Oh, gosh, man, that 2J is probably going to really shine on this one. Oh, man, y'all. Glad I got the nitrous. All righty, let's see how we did here. Ironically, the 2J was the dot that was... Oh, wow, I barely got that. It was the dot that was closest behind me, but I really pulled away for some reason. It didn't have anybody in front of it that time. But, uh, uh yeah, I'm probably going to want to use nitrous at the start in order to keep it from passing. Because it will pass, and, well, you'll have a bad day. Because I'm afraid once he passes, I'll never be able to get, never be able to. nitrous here just a little bit okay good maybe if I just stay in front he'll behave himself or not or maybe he'll be right on my bumper immediately when I look back. I should have known that was a ridiculous prediction. Oh my gosh. Please stay back there. Still can't get away from the sucker. Oh man, hitting those walls ain't gonna help us either. this Camaro so hard, y'all. Oh, man. Wheel spin's not a good thing. Now, when you got a 2J riding you.
Hopefully I'll be able to win, but I'm not getting away. Near the 2J in a sweet sing song for us. You can run, but you can't hide. Man, I'm really doing pretty good on the straight. Yeah. I love how as soon as I say I'm doing pretty good on this track, I hit a wall. And he got a little closer to me. Let's just say here, except I, I love how I shifted in the fourth earlier, or fifth. This is only uh, four laps, so. Mm. Oh my gosh, she's gaining on me a lot. Oh my gosh, she's right on my bumper. Oh my, it's over. Woo. Good Lord, I could not have held him off for another lap. And then everybody else was just way back there, like literally years. I mean, <laughs> it's, it's bad when a Viper's finishing fifth and a Corvette's finishing sixth in every race. It, it's bad. It, that just shows you the opposition. Golly, man. Yep. This is this is a thing. Oh my. Two more, y'all. One of them's El Capitan, though. The other one's Laguna Seca, which I'm probably going to suck at. But El Capitan should be okay. I think. Hopefully. Shouldn't be too bad. 10,000. Some very hard earned money there. Alrighty. Of course, it would have to be El Capitan Reverse, naturally. Alright, practice. I really kind of sucked on this lap, but maybe I got it. Five seconds. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not going to let that encourage me too much. Because, well, it's the 2J. <laughs> Poor Viper got last. Darn. Alright. Golly, it starts right. Oh, man. And this is actually not a rolling start. Oh, my. Not good. Yeah, it. Yeah. Not good. At all. Freaking 2J. Oh man, I'm not good at this track at all. Reverse. He's actually going slow in this section, though. Surprisingly. I 
Oh, wow. I can't believe it. <laughs> I passed the sucker. Oh, now he's going to give me a boost. How sweet. Okay. I did a lot better than that on qual than, than I did on qualifying. They kind of sucky on that, but I guess I did as good as he did. Oh man, y'all suck at this track on reverse. So bad. But my heavens. We got a little bit of lead here. I thought he was going to run away with it. I messed up there. He's keeping up with me though. Oh God. Oh my, no, no, no. <laughs> I was saying, where in the heck is he? He's actually back there behaving. I can't believe it. Well, that's kind of how I did on the qualify. Not good. Okay. So good that the computer sucks on El Capitan. Because I know that I suck on this track reverse. So. If I wanted this track were forward, I would freaking slaughter them probably. This Camaro's pretty good on a uh, tire wear too. Okay, this curve up here that I got to break for. That I, for some reason, tried to take full throttle on the last lap, and I messed it up this lap. Oh my God, I missed it up bad. Oh, why? Why am I retarded? Is there a special reason why I am? Gosh. I hate this track reverse. Hate it. Well, now he's just getting down, ain't he? Okay, still got this, maybe. Don't give up hope. Oh, wow, how am I even keeping up on the straight here? Because he had must have had a really bad exit on that corner. Come on, Camaro, ride to victory, baby. Let's have a good lap, please. Good as in, oh, whoa, he actually screwed up there. And I didn't even have anything to do with it. This curve, gosh. 
Chiefs. Now, I know this track really good forward, but reverse is a different story. Although I'm getting to know it better. Tires barely might make another lap. Jeez, look at this lap, 137. How much better it was than the other laps, gosh. We won though, hey, we won. <laughs> Nobody else finished besides the Pinos. Pinos Esperante. One more race, y'all. Then we won't have to deal with this 2J anymore. One more race. Oh, I got a horrible launch there. Horrible. that too, Jay. Y'all, she took it easy on this track. She actually hit that a couple times. for the pass. Ooh. What a race. Oh y'all, Laguna Seca. That's all that's left. The good thing about Laguna Seca for us is that it doesn't have very many high speed sections. So that could work in our favor if I drive ride. Big if. Alrighty. Practice as usual. Alright, well I had a little mess up where I had a lot of wheel spin earlier in the race. But, yep, still got it. Uh, of course, we know that's no indicator of how... It will actually go with the pen Pinoz Esperanto actually passed me because it's, I stayed so long in the pit. But uh, let's do this. Oh, well, the Esperanto actually is last, wasn't it, on this one. Corvette's third. Interesting. Interesting, I'd say. Yep. Corvette, then the Ford GT, and then the Viper. Yeah, the fact that this, God, track doesn't have very many uh, super high speed sections might actually work in my favor. Of course, understeer is an issue for some reason. Oh my gosh, that's the same place I messed up in the qualifying. Same exact place. Didn't learn from my mistake, did I? He slowed down a lot more than that than I did. I don't know if it's because he was right behind me or what, but either way. I'm just driving in particular just really crappy on this. And I'm getting away. I don't know how. 
Alrighty then. That was horrible. How dare I cut that? Okay, for some reason the chaparral is kind of chilling on this track. After giving me a big scare at the beginning. Oh my Jesus, don't do that. Naturally, he's going to gain on me through this section because I suck at it. Yeah, on uh, Grand Turismo 3, I actually think I did the whole Laguna Seca Endurance race with this car, this exact car. Lucky for me, it seems like the chaparral is taking it very easy on the corkscrew section. I also don't know why, because he, he could do a lot better than this Camaro could. Okay, did that curve better this time. No 21, not a bad lap. And almost a six second lead. to this to be a, kind of a tough one considering my lack of skill of Laguna Seca. second okay, he did block the game a little bit okay screwed that up but could have been worse. Oh, yes, it could have been. And of course, everybody else is really chilling. You know, they're way back there. Okay, still got almost a six second lead. Broke way too late on that, but hooray for good braking and good car. The lap wasn't that bad. Seven and a half seconds. Wow. What are you doing, Chaparral? Just chilling on this track. My, why, why did I mess it up? I didn't do as bad as lap one. Jeez, I don't know what I'm doing. Keep shifting weird times. Much better on that corner there. Oh, they gained on me a lot. Back up to seven point eight then. He's just taking it easy on this track, gosh. Which I guess it pays to take it easy on the good second. Say I'm so concentrated. Of course, that's how this whole championship's been. I can't believe it, man. My third biggest victory would be on Laguna Seca. Is this my third biggest? No, second biggest.
Most of them have been close calls. The biggest one was uh, Infineon. El Capitan could have been, but I kind of sucked on that, so. I'm not good at that track reverse. You know, you never do Laguna Seca reverse, but freaking El Capitan, why can't it be one that you never do reverse? Be nice. It's kind of cool reverse, though. It really kind of is. Just look at it. Oh, wow, best lap at the end. Eight seconds behind, maybe. 9.4, wow. The Viper got third on that. Actually beat the Esperante. The Ford GT got last. Hmm, that might mix up the points a little bit. A little, maybe. Yeah, in the end, the Viper beat the Ford GT. Corvette got last. All right, well, golly, that was rampageous. That's probably not even a word, but I'm making it a word. <laughs> Com com combination of rampage and outrageous. All right. Whew. And you really should win more than 35000 for that. That is not enough. I'm just saying. Golly, man. Of course, that being said, it was very easy to win this Camaro, but this Camaro is barely even able to do this. If you have the 2J. If you don't have the 2J, it's pretty easy, actually. I mean, the other cars were no opposition at all. Oh, oh man. Look at that. Gosh. What a beauty. Mm. Can't wait to drive that, y'all. We, we, will, we will definitely be putting that to good use. Oh, man. It's so, so sexy. Gosh. Hallelujah that that's done. Jeez. I probably don't have anything that I really want. Oh, wow. This Lancer. You don't see this very often. Lancer EX Turbo Intercooler. Not the oldest Lancer. I think there's like a 73 Lancer. Ooh, forgive me, yawning. Other than that, I don't see anything too interesting in there. Unusual. It's April 1st. April Fool's. Oh man, that was so hard, gosh. 365 days, we've been doing this for exactly, exactly a year. I guess, I guess it started on April 1st, didn't it? I didn't even pay attention to what day we started. We've had 189 races, we've lost eight of them. Golly. All right, well, let's check out that beautiful car that we just won 152 horsepower pretty good for a 54 yep this was a fast thing back in the day of course I would never sell this but you know 21,000 yeah man beautiful beautiful um, just come and stalk it actually has it only tops out like 110 or something like that but you know we'll definitely fix that all right my friends well as we stare at this beautiful car we're gonna stop right here thank you all very much for watching this has been sky hurricane have a super awesome blessed day and as always my friends stay awesome goodbye y'all